Welcome back to the channel guys. This is episode 3 of My Rise. Last time we took on Beth Phoenix, Jersey Jane and Tamina. Now it looks like we get to rub things into Jersey Jane just a little bit more. Your submissions are weak, just an FYI. Really? Still stronger than she is. Maybe you need an up close demonstration. No. I can see how weak they are from a kilometer away. What makes you such an expert anyway? I'm from Calgary. We have a great tradition of submission wrestling. I thought you were from Saskatoon. That's close. Is it? Well, I trained in Calgary. <laughs> I know, we all here. know. You trained in Calgary, home of the world-famous Hart family, and they taught you everything you know about wrestling. Well, no. I trained with Riley Flash, and he was trained by a guy who trained with a guy who knew them pretty well. Uh, so, she wasn't you know, 2K20. Osmosis. That's why she seems familiar. Sounds like your science is as weak as your geography. Makes sense, though. Riley Flash is the Saskatoon of wrestling. Oh. I know you're insulting my mentor, even if I'm not exactly sure how. But we're getting in the ring for a good old-fashioned Calgary submission match to settle this. Calgary submission match. What's a Calgary submission match? Same as a regular submission match. But someone from Calgary is in the ring. So, really a Saskatoon submission match. <laughs> you wanna She's... wrestle or not? She's burning into something savage today. Take it easy. Let's find out whose submission game needs work. All right, and I did add a submission finisher. We'll wait until I get a chance to use it here before we do the big reveal. All right, to start off, burying the head into the mud. That was actually a nice, nice drop kick off the ropes there. That wasn't the move I thought I was gonna do. So I updated things just a little bit. I'm pretty happy with most of her moveset, but there was just a couple of things that that I wanted to to change. Oh, okay, that that was really bad timing. All right, few punches, few slaps, bit of a neck breaker. Inseguri. We're just walloping Jersey Jane here. Oh, okay. Oh, no, I forgot to change that. Alright, we'll close liner out of the ring. It's all good. Okay, um, that's, that's not what I'm trying to do. You gotta get up there. Give it time to wake up before you do a move. There we go, moonsault off the top rope. Uh, she reversed it. Of course she reversed it. It doesn't let you do any more than three moves in a row before it decides it's just going to reverse everything. Yeah. <laughs> Sometimes it just completely misses. Uh, so a lot of the moves I did keep. The moves that wasn't too bad. It's just wanted to go a little, just wanted to upscale things just a little bit, just so it can make the action a little bit better. Alright, we've got her stunned. Here we go. Here's our new signature. I said I was going to swap it from the Bulldog. Oh yes, look at that. How cool was that? Alright, so yeah, got it ready. Here we go. And we've got the Black Widow, Shades of AJ Lee. It was one of my favourites when she was with the company. Not sure what she's doing now, but wish she'd come back. She was only tiny, but she was really cool. 
Alright, so I'll just punch her a little bit more. She wasn't quite ready to submit. Oh, yes. Knees to the face. I, I don't think we'll ever get tired of defeating Josie Jane. She's just one of those people that, that's meant to get under your skin and she's doing a very good job of it. So all through this series, I'm sure we'll we'll come across her and... Oh, what the, what's this move? This... Just, just chucking me around like a child. Come on, man. Alright. Oh no. Of course another counter. I told you, can't do more than three moves. More knees to the face. I actually meant to do something a little bit different, but that's alright. Spike ahead into the ground. I oh, hand it was a submission match. Alright, that, that's okay. We'll just... We'll just do something else. I think we got her. I think we got her. Too easy. Tap, tap, tap. Josie Jane is done. Alright, story complete. Alright. Well, that was easy. Got something cool lined up if you're interested. You of could course. be in the next WWE 2K video game. Really? Me? Really? That's amazing. Well, to be clear, it wouldn't be you, as in like a character that is you. But when someone is getting beat up in the game, that will be your movements. Okay. You're not really selling this. So my core is going to become a core. You get to wear one of those cool mocap suits. Get to? Basically, <laughs> the producers of the game need you to last five minutes with a WWE superstar so they can get enough footage of their moves. Would I at least get a free copy of the game? No promises. So do oh, you want to do it or no? Come on, 2K. After they see me in the ring, there's no doubt they'll give me a bigger role. Guess you're gonna do it. That's the spirit. Not even a free copy. No, nothing. Just you know, she's at the PC. Just gonna take advantage. Not cool, man. Not cool. Make her wear a silly suit and everything. Here we go. I guess at least if she was doing this for Mortal Kombat, she'd be her own character. If anyone ever played that game and remembers good old mocap, one of the worst characters ever, but at least he got his time in the sun, I guess. Alright, so this is going to be running around doing a few moves for five minutes I think through the power of editing we can just fast forward this one just a little bit all right down to the last 20 seconds of the match it's been good beat the hell out of each other Raquel has spent most of the match reversing almost everything I've thrown at her, but that's okay. Had a few scary moments, but we survived. And that's the bell. Then I just put that on. I knew it wouldn't have time to make a tap. <laughs> Alright, so that's two little challenges we've got done already. So we're ticking them off the list nice and quick here. Let's just have a quick look. Lots of heal stuff to do. And there's a few that don't really have any alignment. I think you can sometimes choose as you go. Alright, looks like we've got a little story here with Beth Phoenix, you know, saying how proud she is of Edge and all the rest of it, blah, 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 blah. So, of course, we have to make fun of her. And now it looks like we're going to be in a mixed tag match. We get to choose... Okay, we get Paragon, Chase, or Hector. Well, they really want to assume that you've done the men's side first, what if you haven't? You know, you, you're not going to know who any of these guys are. But you know, I don't don't like 
Don't like Paragon. Why why would we want to choose him? I think I think we'll go with Hector. Because I think his style might work pretty well with ours. So yeah, definitely definitely not gonna go with Paragon. Don't don't like Paragon. Alright. Hector's on board. Alright. Let's get into the next match. Alright. So, I'm probably not going to tag Hector in if I can help it. But if Beth makes a tag, then I have no choice but to use Hector. So, he'll no doubt get a run at some stage. I actually like some of these little stories that they've got going so you can really get the feel of things in the performance center. Still, some of these moves just don't seem to want to work. When you do the heavy attack off the ropes, the timing of it seems to be you've got to go really early otherwise they just collide with each other. Beth looking around, seeing who's watching. Yeah, no worries. It's just Edge over there, but he can't really see to you. Oh, well, she's going for a submission on the ground already. That's it, just near in the head. Alright. DDT on the outside. Let's get, get back into the ring. Oh, I, I, I was hoping I'd hit that. That would have looked really cool if I had have nailed that one. But instead, I just ended up on my face. Alright. Let's go. Let's let's try and get this over with as quick as possible. Oh, I thought she was going to end up in the corner then. I just gave Edge a free tag. Oh! Okay, what, what's with the meditation? That's... That's kind of strange. Didn't know I had that move. Maybe I'll have to change that one too. Uh, oh, straight in the face. That's just... That's just nasty. Okay, clothesline. Took it down. It's, this little... Little lady is really taking it to Beth. Off the top ropes. Here we go. Oh, look at that. Look at that. What a move. That's almost a finisher just as a standard move. I might see if I can win with that at some stage. Here we go. Spinning around. Oh, yeah. She's... Sounds really weird when there's no crowd to to go with some of these noises that they're making. Oh, just picked her up by the hair and dropped her on her head. Oh no, she's going to make the tag. And I'm automatically stunned. Alright, well, I guess we're just going to have to use Hector for a little bit until we can get back in the ring. One thing I do like about this game is you can kind of just grab anyone and start playing the only thing that might change is some of the some of them like signatures and finishes you might have to be in a certain position whether it's running or on the ropes or something like that but generally speaking everyone's pretty easy to to get the hang of oh Beth made the tag okay oh straight out I thought she moved for a second there. I thought I was going to end up on my back again. And finish it on the outside. I haven't actually thought of a good name for that move yet. So we're just going to continue to spike people on their heads. Sounds good to me. Not really a fan of that finisher either. I might change that at some stage. Oh, there we go. Spiked. Uh, Edge is going to come in, isn't it? What? What did he just do? Is that some 
some kind of magic that he just stopped the referee or okay that, that's not a good spot to do that see look he just reaches out and and I know that they don't want the the men to be able to attack the women which I can understand why they do that but at least like grab her by the foot or something and and take her off the pin or break up the submission in another way rather than just sticking your hand out like that it looks silly uh, she's warming up the bicep oh okay yep still didn't let me counter now she's just trying to rip my arm off come on seriously she's only little go easy on her slash me all right finally got the counter in hit her with the neck breaker let's go let's do some damage there we go blur from the corner alley-oop all right i'm gonna try this signature no, apparently she doesn't want us to. Why why does this always happen? I actually find that particular reversal is pretty easy to find the timing on. And I don't want to make the tag here, so I'm just gonna have to pick her up. Ah, just kick to the guts. Oh, no 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 don't no oh, man. Alright, got Hector back. That was a decent clothesline from Hector. Alright. Let's go. Spanish flight. European uppercut. Let's go, Hector. Let's take it to edge. Making these legends look pretty soft, to be honest. Alright, I don't know what that's called, but, you know. It still looks pretty good. Oh, no, there we go. Told you, three moves, they have to reverse it. Oh no, I missed... Not paying attention. Okay, he's gonna tag Beth back in, let's go. Hector's stunned, but it doesn't matter. I don't need him. Alright. Now, let's go. Get her up. I'm gonna do this hurricane runner off the top rope. Oh yes, that's a super move. I really like that. That's that's a cool signature to have. Alright. Now we'll make a tap. Come on, Beth. Tap before Edge comes in and does his little magic wave. This is ridiculous. He wasn't even close like he has some kind of special power all right let's rip her leg off no no edge what 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 is that come on 2k for, for the next game you, you gotta do something a little bit better than just coming in and, and throwing your hand out there and that breaks everything up all right come on Hector get in the ring Faster. No. There we go. It's taking him out. Alright, here's our chance. We've got the rings of Saturn. Come on. Take her out. Tap, tap, tap. There we go. Beth is done. Hector did his part. Thank you very much. Alright, so that's another one that's been done. I was hoping that would be a little bit of a longer storyline, but that's okay. What else have we got here? Alright, so we've got this one from Sean asking us to, to study our history. Oh, normally acknowledge the past, disrespect the past. Oh, hang on. Oh, I didn't mean to press that. I wanted to disrespect the past just to see what would happen, but that's okay. Oh, looks like we get to 
to face China in our dreams. But you know what? We get to face her and we get to see the, the entrance that I've worked on. Ninth wonder of the world. All right, cool. Let's run with this one. Here we are on Monday Night Raw. Superstar. All right, cool. The entrance video working really well. Don't know how it's going to go on some of the other arenas that that have the the other screens around the arena because sometimes it tends to put up names of other other superstars that. You don't want there. It's the one thing I don't like about the, but she's never the way that no we have to, to do entrances now. She thrived under the grueling training at the Performance Center and continues to prove herself today as a WWE superstar. Little butt shake. It's alright. She looks like she belongs out there in front of the crowd. That's the main thing. It is always an awe-inspiring sight. The oh, ninth right. wonder of the world this is China. From Redondo Beach, California. The, the, the face doesn't quite look right. China! Especially when you can see the face there in the video the right behind her. You've seen on many occasions she's been a very powerful ally to some. Yeah, but more often than and not, overall, China she does look okay. It's just the, the face. Enemy face isn't quite right. She's held both the Intercontinental and Women's Championships in WWE and tonight China looks to add to her If you never got to see China actually wrestle, look up some of her stuff. She was really, really good in the and ring. Didn't care whether she was against the men or the women. The she would take on everybody. Sunset flip powerbomb. Quite like that. In the body of a WWE right, superstar. Shouldn't try and punch China in the face. She, she's she's not gonna like that. You're probably not gonna win. All right, at least I got a counter. She counters right back on China. Right. So far, so good. I did put the difficulty up just a little bit. I don't want it to be on legendary only because I do want to get through some of these things for the story's sake, not necessarily for these long drawn out epic matches. Trying to get this thing done as quickly as possible. But it is on hard just to to make it a little bit more of a challenge. Able to get the advantage here. Right, that was a good kill. And China is getting work right. done right now. China needs to be resourceful. And the in neck this breaker. Situation. And now she's climbing That's to the top. Combo. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, look at that. The first 450 splash. And still hanging on. I thought I had it for a second there. That would have been surprising. Alright. Yeah, I meant to do a different move, but never mind. Alright, let's go. Knees to the face. Into the corner. Can we get her? Can we get her? Here we go. Hurricane Rana off the top rope. There we go. That's a cool signature to have. Black. Alright, we go. Go for the pin. I don't think we've done enough, but we'll go for the pin anyways. One, two. Yeah. Are we sure that wasn't three? 
I expect him to keep that. You can get sometimes when you unleash your best offense and it doesn't but it was quite dramatic anyway, so it was pretty good. That's a real oh, she's in the orange. We're getting there. Showing on the face of China. Yeah, China uh, really needs to reassert herself back into this match. Oh, okay. I really got to remember to press a different direction. I don't mean to be doing the same move all the time. Got China cinched in. Oh, dear. X Factor. And the aeroplane. Tilt a roll head scissors. <clears throat> or tilt a roll head scissors, if that's what you want to call it. I'm calling it an aeroplane. Quick thinking from China. And China needed that badly. Okay, you go. can tell China's extra agitated now. I thought I got the first one. But made sure I got the second. Uh, let's go. Great drop kick. Oh. And now she I forgot to change that one. Hand. She's unloading move. Didn't mean to. Do that, so that's cool. That's Allows me to do this. Which way to topple the competition? Hurling your own body like that is insane. Did you hear the impact? This is actually the really cool being able to fly like that. Throw her back in. We've got her pretty badly beaten up. Sling, sling blade into the drop kick. drop kick. We've got a stunned. Here we go. And spiked. Is that enough? Let's go. Come on, ref. One, two, three. Look at it. Alright, guys. That's it for this episode. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Don't miss out on any of the action. We've got way more My Rise to come. We're going to be going through this performance center pretty quickly so we can get into some of the bigger brands. But for now, thank you so much for watching. And we'll be back again very, very soon.